Turning now to Taoyuan, where the first military call-up of female reservists is ongoing. President Tsai visited their camp in the morning during shooting practice. She addressed the soldiers, saying that they were helping to bolster national defense. She also urged the Taiwanese people to unite behind the new mixed-gender recall policy. Let's hear from her. I noticed that some of our female officers and soldiers took leave from work to report for duty. Some left their children temporarily, all to do their part for the country's defense. Your participation not only strengthens the combat readiness of the reserve forces, but also the military's logistics system. This training course is grounded in real battle scenarios. Its guiding principle is to mobilize on home soil and fight on home soil, arming each and every participant with the ability to defend your homeland. Taiwan is at the front line of the defense of democracy. We must unite and show the world that we're determined to defend our country, regardless of our gender. This first cohort of female reservists will complete their five-day training on Friday. Tsai vowed to make the training program more intensive to prepare Taiwan against China's looming threat.